Hi guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make glass eye customs. So, it's not actually glass eyes, but they do look like glass eyes. And it is definitely a process to make these, but they're super fun to make. And I think that they look super cute. So, here are two that I have. I have this Persian cat that is actually on my Etsy for sale right now. She is $20. And her eyes are really pretty. And then I also have this little lizard. This one's eyes have little moons and I think that it is super adorable. Without further ado, let's get started. Here is the custom that I'm using. I also highly recommend using gloves because if the resin gets on your fingers and hardens, it hurts and I learned from experience. So please be super careful if you don't have gloves. We are going to start off by blow drying our custom. This is optional, but it does make the plastic softer and easier to cut. All right, so once you soften it, you're going to get an X-Acto knife and you're gonna cut along the eye. All right, once that's cut, we're gonna start the actual eyes. Now with the doll glass eye molds, I'm going to add some resin. Now I'm going to use a toothpick to even it With this small amount of white paint, I'm going to mix it in. And now I'm going to cure under the UV light. With a nail file, I'm going to file off the excess resin. Alright, so I'm going to be using this really pretty pink glitter. When I use glitter, I get a little bit of Mod Podge on a brush. And I brush the inside of the eyes. So I'm going to use some tweezers to dip the eyes inside. Now I'm going to add a really small drop of resin to the top of the eyes. And now I'm going to add the little gems into the eyes. I'm going to cure it under the UV light. Now we're going to use cotton balls to stuff the pet's head. I just grab pretty big chunks and I use tweezers to push it in. Now we stick the eyeballs in. Now once you like how it looks, you're going to get some resin and do a small layer on top of the eyes. And now I'm going to get a little toothpick and just even it out. And now I'm going to cure that eye. And then I'm going to move on to the other eye. Now I'm going to cure this eye. And then with some glossy Mod Podge, I'm going to just put a light layer over the eyes because the resin is a little bit sticky and can leave fingerprints. So this way, the resin will be untouched. Alright, this is how my little kitty turned out. I think that she looks so cute. If you guys would like to see the finished painted product, please follow my Instagram so you guys can see my custom up. I hope this helped and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye!